after his money I mean a concert flopping uh, for Gravitom to you he is still showing that uh, uh, he's one of the biggest Ugandan artists in the uh, hip hop and uh, in the Ugandan music. Uh, welcome back to Rex TV Uganda. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Recently, Gravity held a concert uh, at Lugogo Cricket Oval, whereby he got not even, uh, I think, uh, uh, less than a hundred people in his concert. Uh, but um, Gravitom Tuju has come out and released a new song uh, called Inje Ulira. Obaye Ulira uh, Lugogo, because uh, during his interview uh, yesterday, he came out and uh, said that uh, he has been in Lugogo for over five times and he has been feeling it and uh, he thinks and he feels it inside that uh, uh, he will be m feeling Lugogo uh, not the, uh, for the first time and this is came out and clarified and said looking at since many artists uh, make shows and they flop uh, just after uh, Gravity coming out in that interview Mick Wine, who was the rival, they did the uh, uh, shows on the same dates, only that for Mick Wine, his show was held at Jazz Piers, whereby after uh, Lugogo flopping, Gravity put his interview press conference at uh, Jazz Pier. Uh, Mick Wayne also came out and produced a song uh, uh, dubbed the Champion, whereby in his song he came out and said, You think I'm a cachere, like uh, how Junior uh, says it, Vijay Junior. Uh, you think I'm a kachere, but this kachere has some stones in it. So guys, <clears throat> this feud is still going on and we don't know where it is gonna end, but uh, let's keep on watching. And uh, we are here to give you all the updates on uh how this is ending let me think that uh, it is a healthy uh feud a healthy battle that uh, will be growing not uh one or two musician but all of them uh since mickey wine had taken some good time without releasing music uh, but uh, after this battle after these two shows colliding uh mickey wine is showing some power of which uh he's one of the legends in the music industry so you look uh, uh, back whereby is the one even who brought Ed Kenzo and now Ed Kenzo uh, is one of the biggest artists in Ugandan uh, music industry. So guys, if Mick Wine comes out and says that he wants it back, guys, what do you think? For me, uh, my take is he can come and conquer uh, the city if at all he, he, he's are willing to because uh, this platform he has been there and he, he can still be there uh, there is a Uganda saying which says uh, so uh, I think he can come out and uh, do it but the gravity uh, his issues that Ugandans the thing that made him to lose this he came out and clarified and he's totally uh, giving a different view for him. He says, uh, depending on what he thinks, it's not about uh, his battle with uh, uh, Bobby Wine because he, he came out and uh, tackled Bobby Wine head on. Uh, taking their uh, two sacks of cement, uh, sand, uh, like that he wants the hospital to be built on Usabala land, whereby uh, on the beach, whereby uh, Bobby Wayne didn't even reply, but uh, this uh, made Ugandans not, uh, I don't know, what, the, what can I say, they became a bit furious, and uh, not a bit, but they became furious. Because afterwards, this is what happened, and Gravity didn't even receive any number. But remember, Gravity has been doing shows like even in Tusimbu the concert. Uh, they came and showed him love, and uh, uh, after that, 
gravity used that same money that you went showing off what and guys like subscribe and comment to rex tv uganda we are here to serve you ciao